comfortable, get comfortable. Come on in. Right here, right now, we are um, on Fly Nubian Queen. You know, it's the network for melanated men and women just like you. So we want. We have some wonderful guests today. We have wonderful guests. I'm here with April Prayer. She's an attorney in Chicago. And the um, I'm here with Shonda Parker. She's also an attorney in Houston, I believe. Okay, awesome, I get that right. <laughs> so we want everybody to come on here right now. We've been talking about Breonna Taylor for days, but before we move on into discussing Breonna Taylor, I just really, I want you guys to know these women. They are powerful in their respective fields. They are doing a great work. And before we go any further, I'm gonna turn it over to April and allow you to introduce yourself to everybody. Hello, Fly Nubian Queen. This is April Prayer. I am a criminal defense and a civil rights attorney in Chicago. This November will make 21 years that I've been practicing. And I have a platform where I break down the law, all those fancy Latin terms that most of us don't understand into basic everyday terms that anybody can understand on my platform. And so I go by the justice junkie. I spell justice a little bit different because there's a saying that there is no justice, there's just us. So that's how I spell it because I'm looking out for just us. And I also have a board game that sprung out of this educational platform, which teaches people how to make it safely home after interacting with police, how to still assert your constitutional rights when you're talking to or interacting with a police officer and how to avoid the criminal justice system and never need my services and never need Shonda's services and stay out of harm's way completely so that we can avoid deathly, uh, deadly scenarios on the side of the road and that we can be informed and apply that knowledge easily, quickly. And actually the game is in a fun and interactive format as well. So thank you so much for having me on the show. I'm super excited about uh, the conversation that we're gonna have today because it's an important one about protecting women who look like us. Absolutely, thank you so much for being here. I am excited. Shonda, tell everybody about you and where you're from. All right, so my name is Shonda Parker and I am a criminal defense lawyer here in Houston, Texas. I have over 17 years of experience in the criminal justice field. I'm a former prosecutor and it was my experience as a prosecutor which led me to come on over to the other side because I saw those injustices and I just, I couldn't handle it. Uh, I wanted to make sure that I was a part of the solution and not a part of the problem and wanted to make sure that people like me, whether they have the money or they don't, uh, could get quality representation uh, in something as serious as a criminal offense or charge on their record. So um, I am also a graduate of Kentucky State University uh, in Frankfort, Kentucky. And um, I am a member of Delta Sigma Theta Sorority Incorporated. And so uh, I say that to say that this kind of hits home for me because I did live in the Commonwealth of Kentucky. I did work for the Commonwealth of Kentucky. And I, I want to make sure that we are able to address those issues and speak to people there uh, in Kentucky. Absolutely, I completely understand. I am too a Kentucky State University graduate. I am too a member of Delta Sigma Theta. This is my big sister in Delta. <laughs> but um, you know, we we went through Kentucky State at different times. But I, I think that what's happening right now in the state of Kentucky is you know is relevant to everybody, no matter what time you you went through the state of Kentucky, or if you're not even um, a citizen of the state of Kentucky. What happened to Breonna Taylor? Um, Taylor seems to be just a complete tragedy in the justice system right now. Nobody seems to have served her. So I want to know from you. 